guys, good morning. Welcome to Vlogmas Day 21. I cannot believe we are literally almost at the finish line and even more so that Christmas is around the corner. For me, I celebrate starting Christmas Eve and Christmas Day because I celebrate with my dad's family Christmas Eve, mom's family Christmas Day. It was actually always like that even before my parents were divorced, but now so it's like more obviously separated. So I have to have all my stuff ready by Christmas Eve morning and I definitely don't yet. I need to figure out some gifts. I need to do all my wrapping. I'm definitely going to be doing some last minute shopping. I know Kyle has some last minute shopping to do as well. We're not going to be doing that today because I am busy with other stuff. I actually just showered and got super clean. I'm drinking my coffee still and Kyle and I woke up very early today. He woke up before me but like our alarms went off at 7 a.m. which is not really like us. We're really trying to start being like early birds. Um, um, but it's definitely hard because we go to bed so late. We're not going to be doing any of the Christmas shopping today because I don't have time and I want to go with Kyle when we have some time. So I think that will either be tomorrow or the day after that. I know very, very last minute. I have most of my gifts. I just need like wrapping paper, that kind of stuff, and then maybe a few extra like little gifts. Comment down below if you guys are a last minute shopper or if you are already all prepared. I feel like it's all over the place for me. I feel like it's especially hard like in this mid 20s kind of transition year with families and stuff because you are like trying to figure out your own life ahead but also still doing like older family traditions that may be like starting to fall apart now and I feel like it's a hard time to it's just a transitional period like overall I don't know how else to explain it let me know if you guys feel that way and maybe it's a different age than the 20s for you but I'm 22 right now and I feel like it's just a lot different with so many of the cousins getting older and some of my grandparents not being here anymore and you know things like that that are kind of emotional but it's also like exciting to start your own tradition so i'm kind of rambling right now but i just feel like christmas has been on my mind for this whole week but let's talk about today because we're not going to be getting into any of that today i honestly can't think about that i'm focused on vlogmas and working cleaning this apartment actually which is what i was about to do right now i wanted to do a little time lapse for you guys um kyle and i woke up extra early today he was already out of the apartment running some errands i think he's getting a haircut um, but I showered. I just did a bunch of skincare. I haven't done like a ton of serums and like skincare in a while So I treated my skin. I need to do my makeup and all of that because I'm going to film a Holiday lookbook today not with this vlog. It will be for a video from before this um, Because I'm still trying to catch up from vlogmas and that's the thing with vlogmas once you get behind It is almost like impossible to actually get back on track, but I'm still gonna be posting all the videos but That's kind of on the agenda to get that video filmed and done early this morning but before we can do that because my room is a disaster and there's actually so much laundry to do i don't know how our laundry stacks up so much but i'm going to be filming in the bedroom because it has the best lighting so i need to make the bed i need to figure out the laundry situation i need to clean off this dresser and overall just clean up the bedroom very well we're gonna do a little speed cleaning montage i'm gonna watch a little podcast drink my coffee still and clean up this room before we get ready then we'll do our makeup and then i'm gonna film this separate holiday lookbook video and then most of the day is probably gonna be editing but i'm gonna try and like vlog other stuff for you guys i'm gonna watch the new wild till nine podcast with lord diy and jeremy i actually really like this podcast and you guys always know i love podcasts that are really long and their videos are always like over an hour long so let's watch this oh this one's actually only 50 minutes and let's do a little cleaning montage <laughs>
I did a quick cleanup. This apartment definitely needs to be wiped down and like more deeply cleaned. But for now, for filming purposes, the bedroom is cleaned up. I love how my curtains look when they're fully closed. I really need to get them hemmed. It's not terrible, but it does kind of bother me. Um, but yeah, the bedroom is nice and clean. I'm going to use this top space and probably the top of my bed, which is actually why I got this bed is because you can hang clothes off of it and it's really helpful for styling. Um, I don't do a lot of styling, but for today's video we are. So I need to steam this green shirt and I'm going to go through my closet and start picking and putting together outfits for this lookbook. Um, and all of the laundry that was sitting in this corner is now out here in the hallway, literally completely blocking the entire hallway. This is the reality of it. Um, I don't have time to sort and actually start the laundry now, so we're just going to throw it out in the hallway. I'm going to deal with this later, but at least the bedroom is clean. Technically, where I'm filming, you wouldn't even see that, but with my brain, that would distract me so much and be so clogged in my brain that I have to get it out of here to be able to film. So that's why we just threw it in the hallway for now. I'll probably do laundry like later tonight, honestly, because that does need to get done. Um, but I think I'm gonna film like here, but I feel like I always film here. Maybe we can film with the curtains in the background. This actually looks pretty good. I kind of like the curtains. It gives like a soft, white look i filmed a lot of videos already with this in the background um i'm not sure i love when my room is clean and i love when my windows are all open you can see the city view it's so pretty the sun went away but it's still like very bright out because it's still pretty early so i have some time i just quickly made a little liquid iv i'm obsessed with liquid iv like i don't know what i would do without them um i just had like a little bit of a headache and i needed to hydrate myself so i filled up my little table rock yeti with some ice water and the um hydrating immunity liquid iv I'll probably have an energy one later. I get them at Costco because you can get the big bags for a little bit cheaper. So definitely suggest that or you can buy them online with people's codes. I don't have a code. I would love to work with Liquid IV, um, but I know like a bunch of different big people have codes. So maybe I should like stock up and buy all the flavors because I've only tried like the basic flavors. It really does just help me feel better and like boost my mood to be honest. And it gets me drinking more water. So... I'm gonna shut up now. We are gonna go to the vanity. Ooh, you guys are stuck in the curtain. <laughs> um, and I'm gonna do my makeup really quickly. Actually, it'll probably take me a little bit longer because I wanna do some pretty full coverage makeup for this fashion video. I still have my coffee. But yeah, I think I'll do a little time lapse of my makeup real quick. Got my vanity lights on. My vanity is a little bit messy, but we will have to work with that. So. This is before. I have no idea where Kyle is right now or what he's doing, but I think we should try and set a goal to be fully ready with makeup on by the time he's back. I feel like it's really cutting it close because he's already been gone for a while, but maybe we can beat him. I was trying to bring Pickles in here because he's sitting in the hallway and look at the cats right now. They're like, why? Like, mom, what are you doing with all these clothes? Olive is in the basket. Kitties, this is not a jungle gym. They love when I move like any furniture, I swear. They'll just like play around and like jump all over it. What are you guys doing? <laughs> Excuse me. You guys are silly. Like I just stayed up a little bit and I got some done.
Your hair is short! It's just the season to get cozy. Did you want it that way? Turn around. Snuggling up with the blanket. Oh my god, Ray, you look like a whole new person! It looks good! Exclusive stories, original podcast, and look cute, more. baby. Discover your holiday love story with. Oh my god, it looks so different! It looks so different, baby. Ready. Go I to can see your whole face. And your whole side of your neck and your whole ear and everything. Okay, so you know what always gets me is those seven day free trials for just about. It's kind of crazy. <laughs> How are you look so different? And I subscriptions to apps or services that I do I know, that's what I'm saying. And well, when big companies keep subscriptions, you don't... You're a baby Kyle! Triple is the new app that helps you identify and for fun to work. simply forgot about because... Okay guys, my makeup is pretty much done. I'm not gonna do my lips yet because Kyle just heated up some egg bites for me. I did a whole video on how I made these and we are still working on them. I have some sriracha on the side. Look how cute. It smells actually really good. So I'm gonna eat those first before I do on my lips and I'm gonna start picking out outfits now. So I'll probably vlog once I'm done with this whole holiday video because obviously that is separate from this. So yeah, I'm gonna pick out all the options from this closet. I don't know if you guys knew that, but this little closet in the hallway of the bedroom is basically like my main closet with all of my more like not fancy items but like sweaters dresses not my comfy clothes basically so these are all my blouses and tops and different things like that so i need to start pulling some options i have this really cute red knit dress i've worn this before i don't even know if this will still fit me <laughs> yeah i'm gonna work on kind of sorting all of this out and i will talk to you guys in a little bit hi guys i just finished filming this holiday lookbook i have the last outfit on right now which i actually am obsessed with you guys obviously have already seen the lookbook it's already on my channel so if you missed it i will link it at the top but I paired these white trousers that I actually thrifted and they have these amazing gold buttons. They're very like 80s, extremely long on me. I have the highest heels on and they're still pretty long, but I love the white pants for Christmas. I know technically in rules of fashion, you shouldn't wear white after Labor Day, but I think that is so wrong. I love a winter white look, especially for Christmas. And paired with the more casual red sweater is so comfy so cute i feel like i might actually wear this this year for one of my holidays with my family yeah i filmed on my vlog camera and i filmed other footage on my big add camera so i have to collect footage from both cameras and start editing this video now because this is the next video to go up i thought i had a video for day 17 and i actually didn't i thought the starbucks taste test video was 17 and that's actually 18 so i've been working on that video as well but i need to get the fashion video done for 17 before that I'm definitely feeling very crazy and chaotic energy right now but i'm happy i got that video filmed i really hope the footage looks okay i feel like it was kind of thrown together a little last minute but i think you guys will still enjoy it and i feel like it makes it like way more realistic that i didn't like go out and buy all these clothes to like make these looks these were all like items that i had in my closet that i've had forever yeah i'm just kind of like overthinking it but i think you guys will still oh my gosh this hoop earring keeps falling out but i think you guys will still enjoy it i think i'm gonna make another quick hot coffee really quick to give me some extra energy a little boost and i'm gonna sit down at my desk i gotta grab my laptop and we're gonna start working on our laptop and on my big mac big mac <laughs> on my imac computer and yeah, I don't know what else I'm going to vlog later for you guys, but I will try to vlog some more fun stuff. Honestly, I'm really going to need a bath tonight or something like that. That sounds so good right now. We got to work first. So let's make a little hot coffee. Actually, I'm going to grab my mug that I already was using. Also, like once I'm already ready and like have makeup on, have like a cute ass outfit on, I just feel 
so much more like motivated and energetic obviously we did not beat kyle with doing my makeup he literally came home like right after i finished or right after i started doing my makeup um and now he's at the gym so we kind of planned for him to be out of the apartment today so i could get all this filming done this morning because it's just easier for me and oh my god out here is so messy you guys are sitting on a bag of potatoes the apartment is such a mess out here there's so much laundry to do i have so much work to get done i feel like i'm always just complaining during vlogmas and i really don't mean to because i love it um it's just like a lot so let's make a second coffee i'm gonna dump this out it's just been sitting how cute is mug by the way i got it from being a beauty insider at sephora how cute. Okay, let's go to the Keurig and I still have my heels on. Well, first off, we need to plug in the Christmas tree. I should have filmed all the looks in front of the Christmas tree, but the lighting just wouldn't have been right. Like the lighting out in the living room is just not very good. Oh my God, these earrings I need to take out. I could have filmed all the holiday looks out here in front of the Christmas tree, which I guess I should have done if I planned it better, but the lighting out here is just super bad and like where the Christmas tree is, it would be backlit because of the windows. Um, so I'd have to have like a bunch of artificial lights and I didn't really want to do that. So that's okay. Um, make my coffee. I recently picked up these new um, McCafe K-Cups from Italy and France. They have like the, I guess the blends are different in different countries. So they have the Venice one, which I really like. It's more of a darker roast and I've really been enjoying it. I already drank all of my Paris McCafe, which I also really liked. Um, it was more of just like a regular medium roast. And Kyle normally likes the blonde roast from Starbucks, which I really like this roast when I get it at Starbucks, but I feel like at home it's like almost too light. I don't know why it's not focusing. Oh, Pickles, I didn't even know you were down there. Hi, Pickles, are you sleeping? You're a kitty with lights all over you. Hi, kitty. I had no idea he was even there and I literally just plugged in the tree. Hi, buddy. While my coffee is brewing, I think I'm actually gonna change into something more comfortable because I am overheating in this and I wanna be comfy while I sit at my desk. So, I guess let's do one of these transitions. All right, comfy clothes are on. I think our coffee is done. This is how you know when it's a bad day. This has literally never happened to me with any mug. I use that thing every time I make my coffee and it has never happened. <laughs> I don't know what's going on today, you guys. It's one of those days. What is happening, girl? You think I'm crazy? Pickles, you think I'm crazy? I'm crazy. Cheers. Hello guys, I feel like I never vlog here with this angle, but I came out here and I'm sitting on the floor at my coffee table with my laptop because I had to record a voiceover and Kyle is in the bedroom playing video games, talking to his friends. So I had to come out here to do the voiceover and I just finished the entire lookbook video which i'm actually i think it turned out really well i was a little bit worried while i was filming it if the footage even looked good i don't know just up the quality of my videos just a tiny bit i would love to like focus on that a lot more um by like using two cameras and different angles and using my big camera my add more often because I've gone like a long time without even using that and I would just use this vlog camera which this camera is still great It's just the quality difference for like specific videos My ADD from Canon is like 
the beast. So anyways, um, I just finished this video. It is processing now and exporting so I can put it on my big computer. I don't know if I explained this to you guys, but the reason I've had to transfer everything I do on my laptop to my big iMac is because the Wi-Fi on my computer, the Wi-Fi on my laptop does not work. Um, I really need to take it to the Apple store. I'm going to do that like once like after the holidays because I don't know what's wrong with it So basically I can't use the internet at all I can't even do airdrop or like connect my hotspot to my computer like the whole Wi-Fi system just doesn't work So I have to export everything to my big computer to be able to actually upload it to YouTube Which has just added a lot more time and stress and complications in this process. Yeah, I really need an editor Honestly, like I really really do. I'm just struggling to I've always been like this and I've always struggled to do this is like giving my jobs to other people Because um, I'm kind of a control freak and just like sometimes I'd rather just do it all myself But I know <laughs> I should have one and I probably need one especially for things like vlogmas I am completely rambling to you guys But the reason I turned on the camera is because I'm pretty sure I mentioned it earlier about the whole Christmas present situation Kyle actually got work off for today. So we're actually gonna go to the mall tonight. I think we're gonna go like within the next 30 minutes once I fully process and get this video up. So it should only take me another like 30 minutes. And once this video is up, we're gonna go to the mall. We're gonna finish up some Christmas shopping. I honestly have to like make a list right now of what gifts I have for people to make sure. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna take you guys with me. I feel like this vlog has actually been pretty long so far since I started it so early. So I don't wanna keep talking to you guys, but I'm gonna take you guys to the mall with us. We're gonna do some last minute Christmas shopping and we're probably gonna get dinner there. Um, I don't know if we'll go out to eat or like get takeout somewhere. And yeah, it'll be a fun little adventure. I already know it's going to be absolutely insane there. I'm going to wrap this video up, get it live, probably change into something warmer and like jeans or something. Just a little bit more, not my sweatpants. I should probably also eat before we leave, eat a little something because I didn't really have a lunch. And I did make homemade clam chowder the other night because Kyle has been requesting it. And I have a whole pot of homemade clam chowder in the fridge. So I think I'm going to heat up a bowl of that, eat it, wait for this video to export and upload. It's kind of a lot of waiting time so I can kind of like do stuff while this is happening. And I think all that laundry, by the way, is going to get done tomorrow. So maybe tomorrow's vlog will be a cleaning apartment vlog. I feel like I haven't even really done one like that yet. And that definitely needs to happen. Okay. Okay, here's my mall outfit. I wanted to show you because I actually really like it. Um, I'm wearing my fuzzy bucket hat. I think I got this from Urban last year. And this printed long coat that I got in the fall. It's from Nasty Gal. I love it. And it's actually not too thick. Even though it's freezing outside, I know the mall is going to be like super hot. And when you're just like shopping and walking everywhere, I'm going to get hot. So this is actually pretty lightweight. And underneath, I paired it with this vest sweater. So my arms are actually exposed. But it looks super cute paired with this coat because it looks like I have a chunky knit sweater on underneath. I actually got this at H&M. It was super affordable and I feel like it looks like way more expensive. Then I have my Levi jeans on that I bought in New York at the Levi store. I love these so much. I'll try and link them down below, like the exact ones. Um, and then my shoes are ASOS, these nude and black boots, and they're super comfortable. I actually did a whole ASOS shoe haul. Oh my god, I'm out of breath. In that one vlog that went missing, the like November missing vlog, um, all of the shoe haul was in there. So you guys unfortunately did not ever see that, but these boots were part of that haul and I really like them. Okay, I am still waiting on my video. We're gonna head out and I think we decided on CPK for dinner, which I'm very excited about. I also really like the salad place at the food court, so I honestly might get it and have that tomorrow for lunch already because it's more of like a lunchy spot. And I used to get it all the time when I lived at home. This is the look and let's go shopping. It looks like that's the show. <laughs> We're riding in the slick ick, Kyle's grandfather's car. They've had this for a very long time. 
and it's perfect for vlogging. It's so comfy, you guys. It's like, how old is this? What year? 96. 96? I feel like it seems older than that. It does seem old. Like the quality is so nice. It's like the couch, literal couch cushions for the seats. <laughs> it's a vibe. Hater blocker hat. <laughs> I don't see anybody I know. You guys, I took the mic off my camera because I probably won't like talk when we're at the mall. I'll probably just do some B roll footage. We're gonna go straight to the restaurant, put our name in because I'm assuming there's gonna be a wait. Um, and then we can go to a few stores while we wait for dinner. So, I'll take you guys along with us. Get to the you guys, we had our first date. Our first real official date at this Granite City. Careful, this is like a crazy new intersection of Troy. Oh. 